Let's take a look at how to do a one proportion Z test on our calculator. To do this, we'll go to Stat, over to Tests, and choose one proportion Z test, which is option five. Um, in the example in the textbook, we were looking to see if our sample of potatoes was suspect, if there was more than 8% defects. Um, so our P naught value is 0 0.08. And in the sample, there were 47 potatoes that had defects out of the 500. The question is, this statistically significant, statistically significantly greater than 8%. Uh, so we choose greater than, and we'll go down here to calculate. And you can see that our test statistic value is 1.15, our p-value is 0.12. That means at any standard alpha level, we would fail to reject the null. Um, that means that this uh, batch of potatoes would probably be accepted. The proportion of blemishes was not too high. Uh, notice also we can draw, whoop, let me try that again. If I go to test, uh, one proportion Z test, option five, I could go down to draw and get a picture of the normal distribution if I preferred. Um, and when I do that, I also have the Z score and the p-value reported as well.